went to a lot of different schools in Antioch, Pittsburgh, Brentwood, and Oakley. We went to junior high schools and high schools and we did a survey on how does the lack of support affect teenagers who use drugs. I'm Adriana. I'm Kia. I'm Greta. I'm Francisco Patino. I'm Raina. I'm Kia. All right, here first, I'm gonna pop up a video on how the childhood drug and alcohol use can affect uh, people long term as an adult. <coughs> Here, drink some of this. Have a shot. The first time you do it, you put yourself at risk because it takes toll. I drink to experiment and also to relieve stress. There's always a reason to do it. I'm stressed. I don't like my parents. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If it goes to public school, like, does it you see what you do? You just want to fit in and, and you just want to try that out. Why is everybody else doing it? There must be something you know, great about it. I was 14 years old when I tried weed with my friends. She had done it before I did, but she showed me it. She said it was okay to do it, and she liked it, and I tried it. It was just a new feeling that I needed to explore further. I started thinking if I only drank on the weekends, I wouldn't get addicted to drinking. But I don't think I'll get addicted though, like, or to any type of drug. In the beginning, I, I felt like I was controlling it, but after that, it, it got out of control. Like, as I said before, I was, uh, I was high for six months. I mean, it was every day. I'd be back there in the alley smoking weed with everybody else. I drank so much that I started throwing up my stomach lining. My health deteriorated. I've lost homes. I've never been able to hold a job. I've lived in, on the streets. I ended up losing my scholarship in college. Everything I wanted to be just went down the drain. I could justify using in order to enjoy myself and other things. I just felt like I was dying. They opened the door for us and she was dead on the bed with the needle in her I gave him a shot of adrenaline to his heart, flatlined it, and killed him right there. But when it's all over, only person has to the Your turn, 
having like having so much fun and thinking that not using drugs is so cool and in style, like a trend, that they're not gonna want to use drugs. They're not gonna even want to hang with kids who use drugs. Not only is it students, it's parents that need to also be aware and help too. So random drug testing could be a thing that can go on within schools to force children to not use drugs.